Hello, I'm Topo Solitario. I'm working on a Green Summon Skies module for Tabletop Simulator. And it's going pretty well. I'm, I was new to Lua Scripting and the Tabletop Simulator UI, but uh, it seems not much complicated. It's hard to do. Uh, right now, I think I have uh, about uh, 300 lines of code for this shit and uh, I don't know about uh, 800 for the UI. That's a lot, but all the information needed uh, is currently in the shit. As you can see, if I press Alt, the shit is uh, fully loaded uh, dynamically. You can see the, the plane type, the pilot name, all the information. Okay, is present in data, not just images uh, or different images for, for all the planes in the game. Uh, this allows you to, to include in your games uh, custom planes, and that's something I, I really wanted to apply, even if I'm very comfortable with uh, the standard planes. Okay, so the next thing, nice things here. First, you can mark your damage. That's uh, okay, first. First thing I want to implement is okay, it works uh, really well. If you click again, you remove the damage, but if you click with the right button, you can add different types of damage. Okay, this is useful, for example, for, for the magnesium rounds, because, as you can see, sorry for, for this. Okay, I don't want that. So, um, you can add for mag magnesium rounds the, the number of, of turns they will be burning in your plane. Okay, that's a nice feature. And as you can see, the the iCraft data sheet, uh, you can move it, or you can scale it, you can clone it, you can do whatever you need. Okay, I'm not finished with that, but I just added uh, something you will really love if you're a Crimson Sketch fan. And that's something that I didn't thought it is even possible using uh, table to simulator. Okay, so we are going to open the damage table, and as you can see, I have this very nice. I'm gonna put the plane behind. Okay, you have this very nice uh, layout here, where you can see all the damage that you can apply to your to your to your aircraft. Okay, so if for example a 60 AP round impacts your plane, you can see that. It is one, two, three, one, two, three, and uh, another three depth. Okay, this is fine, but, and it's pretty fast. I think it's faster than doing it with pen and paper, but this is uh, something you're gonna love. Okay, I click 60 AP and boom, all the damage just goes there. Another round, boom. Now a 70 AP, bomb, okay. Now for windowing, I don't, I didn't uh, write yet um, a windowing calculation, so you can mark these boxes by hand, but it's uh, a very quick, quick, a really quick way of, of adding damage, okay? In fact, if you want to add damage uh, from behind, instead of clicking the left button, you click the right button, okay, and the damage applies in the other direction, okay? This is something that you can calculate, for example, from this line to below its uh, rear damage, because sometimes in Crimson Skies you can get situations like this, where a damage at this point is coming from behind, okay? So it's uh, impossible to, to do it um, uh, automatically. You have uh, to choose with left button from, uh, from the front, and with right button from, from the back. But it works pretty, pretty, pretty well. I'm really excited how, how well it goes. Uh, you see? Okay. So this is uh, what I want to show you. Currently, I have all the iCraft sheet implemented. I mean, all the information that can, can be put here, you can do it, okay? You can add the... Yeah, there are boxes and, and layout for, for all the information here, but currently the, the, uh, I'm focusing on, on the damage template. I'm almost done with it, so the next one will be very similar to this. I mean, opening the maneuver template, and you will just choose the maneuver, and all the information will be filled here. 
okay, for the current maneuver. There will be a global control to take uh, account of turns and current phase. So even the other players will not see the maneuver you choose until you get to the next phase. Uh, you're gonna love it. Uh, the, the results here is getting really, really awesome. As awesome as the, the bear bomber back there. Okay, so that's all. Thank you for watching.